Good morning everybody. Well this is going to be a video about um, life. You might want to take a seat and what me. Oh, I woke up feeling great. Today was made for me. And life is good the way it should, the way it was meant to be. And it's a beautiful day. It's been one of those, um, it's been more than weeks, really. It's been very tough, shall we say. Um, life seems to be very shit at the minute. And as you, most of my viewers already know that I don't pull any punches. I will just tell it as it is. Um, I've been incredibly up and down. Um, as you can tell, um, my voice is all right at the minute, so I'm um, me. But uh, I'm not in a mood to be jovial. Um, I'm barely keeping it together, really. It's been like it for a while, but the videos that you see, I try to be happy and jolly and uh, not play to the camera because I don't think I do that. But I think I just try to make everybody else happy, and I can't be fucked at the minute, frankly. <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> um, apart from, I do try to keep Rodney happy. Don't you, Rodney? Rodney. Rodney! Rodney! Here he is. Look at that face. Rodney keeps everybody happy. And David's about somewhere, but I don't know where he's gone. I don't know where he is. He's in the garden somewhere. But, um, yeah, everybody seems to be being a bit of a shit at the minute. Not Lee. Lee's not being a shit. Um, uh, and me being a shit, but not meaning to be, I don't think. Apart from some people. But, um, I think when people are down, I think they should realise that it's actually okay to be down. I think that's a big thing and they should talk things through and try to let other people help them um, and that's a big thing about being on YouTube I've, found, I've got a community of people and even though they don't realise it they really help like I'm in a group of these people these weirdos <laughs> and um, even though I might not participate I do watch the chat I'm a voyeur if you like and they really do cheer me up so maybe they don't even realize that they cheer me up but they really do um, and I do find that um, well, no. I do find that they <clears throat> The cat's really cheering me up as well. He just goes, because he's very sweet. Um, people on YouTube. Uh, yeah, because they, they're not, they haven't really made any judgments. So if, you, if you're down or anything, they'll try and help. It doesn't matter why you're down or anything. They're, they're just themselves. And it's really, really nice. Whereas people who are friends and stuff, they'll be, oh, you'll be all right. Come on, stop being stupid. You'll be fine. Whereas, in fact, um, many a time, in the last few months at least, I've been on the verge of 
not very nice things. Um, and these people have really, really helped. I mean, even waking up today, I felt really bad when I woke up. So I thought, well, fuck it, I'm going to do a video. Came down and it was like, I'm on the verge of tears. And then just talking about this group of people and it, they're so fantastic and so friendly and so nice. And even though they're on the internet, it's really, Hello, world, no. <laughs> Even though they're on the internet, um, you, you, they can be classed as friends. So I'd say to anybody who is really, really depressed or upset, just go online and try to chat to people. Um, because generally also that's where I've got my confidence from. Other people saying, oh, actually, no, you're really, you know, gorgeous or something. Um, and they've got no reason to be nice apart from being nice. So there's so many pluses for doing this, whereas people in real life, There always seems to be an ulterior motive, almost. You know, yes, I have felt shit. I, you know, I can't do very much. I can't... I'm desperate to help my mum and dad, and I can't do that. Or, frankly, the kids are bloody ready to disown me, I think, because they hate the way I look, I hate the way what I do, everything. And I know it's their age and everything, but the way they're going about things is not very nice. And I know they're children and everything, but it just makes you feel really shit. Lee's, if it wasn't for Lee, then I don't know what would have happened. Well, I do know what would have happened, but it's probably best I don't talk about that. But, um, oh, and of course, Rodney. <laughs> Ow, and David. You can always trust. Look, Rodney's giving David the evil eye. But you can always trust animals, I think. Love them. But, um, I honestly think that if you be true to yourself, and if you're not feeling good, Oh, see, that's just contradicted myself. But at least I feel a bit better at the moment. Actually, I do feel better at the minute. See, that's how up and down I go. One minute I'm, I came downstairs in front, ready to be in front of tears. And then I started doing a video, I'm feeling better already. I can't keep up with my emotions at the minute. It's fucking awful. God. Um, anyway. Um, so this has really just been a video about talking, being true to yourself and trying to help yourself get out of a mode of thinking that isn't good for anybody by talking to other people online who, are, who actually are quite, maybe that's just my group, maybe they're just nice people. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but um, if you could go over to all their channels, that would be fantastic. And go and support them. Thank you so much. Anyway, um, I'll try and do another video soon. About something, I don't know what I have. Something. Um, yeah, I can't think anymore. That that do is ten minutes of me talking rubbish. So, oh, I found my necklace that I'm going to wear, my unicorn necklace. Oh, that's another video I can do. Not about unicorn necklaces, but about other things. Okay, that's me done. All right, over now. I woke up feeling great. Today was made for me. And life is good the way it should, the way it was meant to be. And it's a beautiful.
beautiful day.